So is SO3 polar or nonpolar? When we look at the Lewis structure, we can see that the oxygens are all symmetrical. They have the same number of bonds and lone pair electrons. And we'd imagine that those oxygens would spread out. Those valence shell electron pairs around the oxygens would spread out. They'd repel each other. And we'd end up with something like this. Here we have a trigonal planar geometry with a bond angle of 120 degrees. Because those oxygens are all spread out and they're symmetrical, we'd expect SO3 to be nonpolar. Let's take a look at the 3D molecular shape. So here's SO3. The actual colors are not correct, but the shape is trigonal planar, rotating in three dimensions. What we can do is take and look at the electronic structure around the atom, the electrostatic potential. And when we do that, we can see that there really is no negative or positive side. There's no poles. And if there are no poles, it's a nonpolar molecule. So SO3 is a nonpolar molecule. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.